This apron captures carbon dioxide directly from the air. It's made of a textile from researchers backed by H&M, as the fashion industry struggles to lower its climate impact. Staff at this Stockholm restaurant are wearing cotton aprons that can draw in CO2 and store it on the surface of the textile. The Hong Kong Research Institute of Textiles and Apparel has developed an amine-containing solution that gives cotton the special qualities. Edward Kerr is the CEO of the Institute. The t-shirts that we made out of this material is about uh, as efficient as about one-third of a tree a day. So, so it, it's not insignificant. Uh, the industrial application of this could be for, um, for us to think about these types of materials uh, capturing carbon dioxide at, at very uh, rich sources, uh, chimneys, uh, uh, power plants, and, and, and places like that. And there uh, you can see that, that it can be a, a very significant uh, mechanism to se uh, sequester carbon dioxide. The aprons in the pilot were produced as an H&M supplier in Indonesia. After use, the aprons are heated to 90 to 100 degrees Fahrenheit, at which point they release CO2 back into a greenhouse. The gas can then be used to help cultivate plants. And that's exactly what staff at the Fotografiska Museum restaurant are doing. They're using the captured carbon dioxide to grow their own vegetables in the basement. The kale, the, the black kale and the green kale. And what will that be used for now this evening? Uh, it's, it's both for a pizza and uh, we have a speci special uh, dish with uh, only the, uh, we call the, the basement kale. I think they're absolutely amazing. It's, uh, uh, it's going to be uh, the next step to, to uh, change the climate and we can actually take care of our own carbon and release it uh, to the plants where it belongs. The textile industry has a large carbon footprint. That's an added pressure for fashion giants as shoppers become more aware of the environmental impact of clothes. H&M Foundation said the innovation could potentially be a game changer in reducing global greenhouse gas emissions. But the development of CO2 absorbing textiles is still at the early stages and their eventual effect on the environmental impact of the textile industry remains to be seen.